Hello, everyone, and welcome to episode five of Parker's Daily Dose. How's everybody doing? Hi, doing great. great. Today, we have two special guests, our assistant principals, Mrs. Peacock and Mrs. Wisniewski. Hi. Hi, ladies. Hi. 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 So we are very excited to have you on our show today, and I just wanted to get some information from you guys so that the students can get to know you a little bit better. So I'm going to start with Mrs. Peacock. Can you tell us about where you grew up and um, where you went to college? All right. Uh, I grew up a little bit in the city, but most of my, I would say, seventh grade and up in Calumet Park which is kind of between Chicago and Blue Island. Uh, therefore, I went to Eisenhower High School um, in Blue Island. Little fun fact, I'm in the Hall of Fame there for bowling. Um, so that's kind of cool. Yeah, we went downstate for bowling many, many, many years ago. Um, and then I went to Bradley University. I got my undergraduate degree, uh, my bachelor's degree in uh, industrial psychology with a minor in business administration. And then after working in corporate America for about six years, I decided I wanted to become a teacher. And so I got my first master's in education from National Lewis University. And then I got my second master's um, in administration from Governor State University. Cool. Then, so how long have you been in education then, Mrs. Peacock? I started teaching way back in 2000. I taught fifth grade for two years at Flossmoor Hills. And then I came over to Parker in 2003, where I taught social studies, uh, grade six, seventh, and eighth. And the last 16 years was eighth grade. Social awesome. Studies. Um, yeah. And then because we are all broadcasting from home, can you tell us who lives in your home with you? Yes. So it's my husband of almost 26 years of marriage. And then it's my two sons. 23 and 19 and both are home uh, because of the whole coronavirus. My son, my youngest son was at Ohio State, came home for spring break and stayed. Okay. Um, and so he's doing his e-learning, his, e uh, his electronic classes online. And uh, so yeah, everybody's home. And We're some of our students might know your other son, correct? Because Yes, Mr. Peacock. Yeah. So that's our oldest. And uh, he does sub from time to time. Um, as he was interning with the Bears. And so he's hoping to get on full time with them. But with all everything that's going on, interviews have been put on hold. And so we're just in a holding, holding pattern. But all is well. We're healthy. We've got food. We've got toilet paper. We're good. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. All right. So, Mrs. Wisniewski, it's your turn. Can you tell us where you grew up and uh, where you went to college and all that good yes. stuff? Yes. All right, I'm a Cal City girl. I grew up in Calumet City, went to St. Jude the Apostle for elementary. My father was a teacher there when I was there. Um, went to Marian Catholic for high school. My undergrad, I went to St. Francis and Joliet, and then both my master's degrees are from Lewis University. Oh, yeah. Awesome. And then um, Mrs. Wisniewski, how long have you been in education? Uh, this is my 16th year in education. I started as Ms. Peacock did, I was actually a drug and alcohol counselor for 11 years before entering education. Um, I started at District 206. Go Trojans! Um, and fact, then made my way over to Parker. Together. <laughs> yes, we did. <laughs> did you hear that? Fun fact. Mrs. Gert and Mrs. Wisniewski used to work together. Yes, we did. Um, and then I started at Parker six years ago. Awesome. Okay. Yeah. And then Mrs. Wisniewski, who is living in your home at this time? All right, so I am married. My husband is here. We um, actually are gonna be celebrating 27 years of marriage. Um, cool. My oldest daughter, Allison, is 25, well, almost 25. And my younger daughter, Stephanie, who you guys all know, who interns at Parker, she is 23. Awesome. Do either of you girls have any pets? No. Uh, we have a we have a zoo at my house. We have three dogs and three cats. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Miss Peacock said, mm -mm, "No." Wow. We're not doing that <laughs> urban Peacock residence. Yeah. None of that. <laughs> All right. Well, we have a really fun little 
a game to play with you guys. It is called All About Mrs. Crawford. Oh, okay. <laughs> Miss King is going to ask you questions specific to uh, Miss Crawford, and the fastest to answer gets the title <laughs> of I Know All About Miss Crawford. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. So I'm going to ask you a question and then just answer as quickly as you can. All right. Um, okay. If you know it, blurt it out and then you'll get the point. And uh, so we'll get ready to start. Okay. okay. All right. First question What is Miss Crawford's favorite color? Blue. Oh. Good job. Yes. Yeah, I had no idea. Well, actually, yes, because she wears blue all the time. <laughs> That's what she said. She said, I wear it almost every day. So, yes, <laughs> that is her favorite color. Um, all right. So, Ms. Mrs. Peacock, you got the first question. All right. Here we go. Second question. What is Miss Crawford's favorite food? Asian or? Uh, I don't know. She's Asian. <laughs> She doesn't eat much at Parker. That's a, well, I could tell I'm you that. I'm asking because I don't think anyone would be able to even guess this. No. I will give you a hint. I was going to say she's Asian, like sushi or. She does have them know. with her very frequently. Oh, she has those shakes with her all the time. Or. That's it. Oh, you're right. The protein <laughs> Right? Yeah, protein those shakes. Yep. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> all right, so we're tied one to one. All right, next question. How many years has Miss Crawford been in education? Oh, I don't know. That's a good question. I don't know. If I had to guess, eesh, I don't know, maybe. I'm going to say 12. And I'm thinking maybe 15. I really Why? don't know. Peacock, it is 15. Oh, wow. That was purely a guess. I just. <laughs> You were close though. I was gonna take closest answer, but Miss Peacock, you got it. You got it right. So, all right. All right. Two one. Okay. Next question. I feel like this one you guys are gonna both know, and you're gonna answer really quickly. So, Mrs. Gert, pay attention. I'm, okay. I'm watching. I'm watching. I think that you have, and I also think you have Mrs. Peacock below you. Yeah. And I have Mrs. Peacock below me on my screen. Oh, so just, oh really? Well, we're yeah. recording my screen, so it'll be. Who, what, what I see. So, so here's Miss Peacock, you're over there, and Miss Wisniewski is down there. All right, here we go. How old is Miss Crawford's daughter, Olivia? Six. Yeah, I was going to say six. Very good. Good job, Mrs. Wisniewski. We are done. Still tied. Do we have a tiebreaker? Is that our last question? Yeah, I mean, I, don't, I only have five. Yeah, so, so this is our tiebreaker. All right. All right, here we go. What does Miss Crawford eat for lunch every day at Parker? Chicken she nuggets has an and apple. Chicken, sa chicken sandwich. She always has an apple, and then she gets a sandwich from the cafeteria. Yeah, but I'm sure it's chicken. Maybe. Yeah, the hot chicken, the spicy yeah. chicken sandwich. Spicy <laughs> chicken sandwich. I feel like you guys worked that question out together. <laughs> we did it the time. Teamwork. So teamwork. teamwork makes the dream work because yes, yes it it is the spicy. Oh, wait, I think do, don't we have one more question? Do we? The fur the very first one. D did have, I miss? We have one more. This will be our final question. Okay. Miss King, you I'm, got the answer up? No, I missed that. Okay, here, wait, let me. I thought there were only five. <laughs> there was one more. Look at your email. The question is, uh-oh. Oh, Michelle, are you back? Okay. The question. Yeah, I think I am. When is oh. her birthday? Oh, we had September, September 9th. There you go. September 9th. September 9th. Yep. Well, I think uh, Ms. Wisniewski. Ms. Wisniewski won. But you know what? You guys know her very well. I will say. <laughs> I think she's. You know, she also used to work at, at Bloom in two hundred six. Really? What? You didn't know that, Miss Gert? Look at that. Yep. What? <laughs> when? 
Uh, let's see. Before she came to Parker, she worked at in District 206. What did she do over there? That I'm not 100% sure, but oh. she was there. Well, I'm going to have to find out. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Well, thanks so much, ladies, for coming on and playing playing along with our trivia game and um you know we're hoping that this is getting out to the students and that the teachers are enjoying it and i'm sure miss crawford crawford will enjoy it when she watches it um, <laughs> yes so um did you ladies catch her on the um special edition of the parker daily dose no which no. one <laughs> We got to resend that out, Mrs. Gert, because I feel like people didn't see that one. I will send it back out. It was actually, um, are you smarter than a fifth grader? It was her and Mr. Hinton. And Ooh, they, I loved it. That. it was yeah. really good. I will have to re, I will resend that out um, this afternoon. Um, yeah, it was, a, it was really a good episode. So. <laughs> Well, we really appreciate you guys taking time out to do this with us and uh, connecting with us and being able to see your faces and uh, it, it makes us happy, so. And thank you yeah. guys for doing this. This is really cool. So thank you. Yep. Yeah. Thanks guys. Miss you. Miss you all. Anything yes. for Parker, right ladies? That's right. Anything. Yes. 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 yes, yes. That's right. Woo. All right. <laughs> all right. Bye okay. guys. Take care. Bye. Bye. Be safe.